Okay, guys. I believe you can see my screen. Um, just give me a sec. Uh, just Mauricio, you're right. Intente, I try to um, I try to write it from the from the cell phone, but I believe the option is not there. So we have this one. Let me write it one more time. So I think it's only it only works in the computer. But guys, if you have it, if you already have it, uh, let me know and I can help you write in it here. So that's okay. Uh, and creo que se borró la Rafa. I think that, that is uh, that was eliminated as well. So uh, help me out, guys. That was earthquake, right, uh, Rafael? The five is lava. Okay. I'm sorry about the spacing. Let me see if I can fit it. Okay, you get the idea. <laughs> it doesn't, three, it, it three. doesn't let me. Mm -hmm. Number Can five just flow slowly. Okay, number five just said that was lava. So let me find it here. Okay, so lava, that sounds okay. Uh, I'm sorry, number three is tsunami. Tsunami. No, number Let's... three is flowing. Let's take a look. Number tsunami. Let me let's see if it matches or if it fits. Uh, actually, tsunami fits. Guys, let us know if you got floating or tsunami. Tsunami. And I see that we have floating already here. Mm -hmm. So that sounds good. Okay, earthquake. Guys, what about the number seven here? Uh, so number seven says... Uh, an explosion with fire, lava, etc. What is that? Eight evacuate. Okay, so eight is evacuate. Uh, Three. Oh, very nice. So evacuate. All right. Number three, what do you have in three? Tor tornado. Oh, let's see if it matches and if it fits. So, four. Okay, Despite, uh, the spacing doesn't help much, but yes. Yes, very nice. So we got tornado. Okay. We are missing number six and number seven, guys. Oh, and number three. One hurricane. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So a very strong wind. So uh, three. Okay. Oh, very nice. Okay, so hurricane. Wait, sorry, I made a mistake. This is supposed to be in. Okay. Number Hurricane. Seven, board. Number seven. Board, board. No, Birds. B -U -R -E. Okay, B U. B U. Oh, what no, 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 no. Ah, no. No, no, no. It doesn't. It doesn't match. Yeah. Number six. 
very bad. Maybe mm -hmm. comes a hard treat. Number seven, guys, what does a volcano do? Explosion. An explosion. E X no. Oh, erupt. Oh, Somebody oh, said. Oh, so let's take a look. Oh, yes. And volcano. Very nice. There we go. So erupt. Okay. Or eruption. Guys, number six. We are missing number six. We can change tornado if you think it doesn't match there. So what do you yes. think? <laughs> Well, in number three, say tidal wave. Mm -hmm. Number six says a very bad event. Oh, number three, tidal wave. So tsunami. But or what do you think this can be? Or what can be? Oh, uh, the same twister. I don't know. Twister. Uh, T W. Twist. I think it's disaster. Third. Disaster. Let's take a look here. So, I. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Volcano. S. T. And R. Hey, very good. You got it. Exactly. So, we finish it, guys. Okay, very nice job. So, we got the hurricane. That is super strong winds, uh, earthquake. That is the most common thing that we have. Uh, tornado, floating, right? Or flood, so water all over. Uh, creo que alguien también dijo overflowing, como cuando algo se rebalsa. Um, this, for example, happens in rivers. Um, what else? Yeah, in some rivers, that's the most common. Lava, right? Disaster. <laughs> Yes. Uh, well, creería que esa es una floating. I think that is flood. Um, yeah, right. Porque no es que solo se rebalse, se inunda. So that would be a floating. Well, ahorita, guys, todas las calles are, they have floatings uh, or over floating. Uh, we have uh, evacuate to move someone from a dangerous place. Very nice. Um, erupt or eruption, right? Like the volcanoes we have. And drought, que es la sequía. We don't really have it anymore. Well, right now, because we are in winter, but um, in some places, right? Like uh, La Union, uh, some, what else? Morazán, I think. So there is a terrible drought. Uh, so questions, doubts, super nice job. Cool, cool, cool. Preguntas con el vocabulario, guys. Do you have any question? No. So if no questions, please, uh, tome la captura, take a picture of this, porque vamos a usarlas. We are going to use it in the next activity. So let me know when you are ready, please. Go ahead. Okay. Hey, okay, perfect, perfect. So uh, hurricane, earthquake, tsunami, tornado, flood, lava, disaster, Evacuate, erupt or eruption and drought. And here we have a little bit of descriptions and um, it says, use the words in the crossword to complete the sentences. Now we have a situation and we have to decide what is the word that bets fit uh, into this description. For example, number one, last night volcano uh, Maui in the hot poured downhill. What can we use in number one? Last night, not last night, volcano. What happens with the volcanoes? Uh -huh. Oh, erupt. erupt. But because this one says um, it is last night, so erupted in the hot. What comes from the volcano? Labor. Labor. Yes, lava. that is, and had lava poured downhill. Very good. What about the others? Evacuated. 
since there are two villages located on the foot of the volcano, so the local um, mm -hmm, was the local population. Population is people, right? Was evacuated, very good. So was evacuated, nice, okay. Number two, the devastation caused by super storm Sandy, particularly in New York, in New Jersey is tragic, but the has at least put climate change back on the map. What do you think? Disasters. But the disaster has at least put climate change. Okay, so let me, let me write it there. Calamity, disaster. <laughs> Guys, do you have any other possibility here? It's a key teacher, but I don't know. I don't remember that. Them. As a so disaster, a drought. Drought, yes. Okay, so disaster. It's talking about how the summer. So uh, drought. Oh. Super strong, uh, super storm, right? Mm -hmm. Don't be floating too. Oh, okay, floating. So disaster, drought, and floating. Okay, so there can be only one answer, guys. So we will come back, and um, and that's okay. Vamos a discriminarlos when we move on. Let's go with number three. Uh, so Mauricio, please help me read number three. After the herd his winter indicated the Black Hands regions in the south east of Europe is now facing its hottest summer and the worst. Okay, so hottest summer, right? Yes, hottest summer. Oh, and the worst root. So, do you think that it can be drought? Uh, so, ¿qué es lo que pasa durante los veranos, right? Probably drought. Do you have any other uh, option? What do people say? What does the fox say? <laughs> There is a song that says, what does the fox say? Okay, guys, uh, do you agree with drought or do you have a different answer? I agree. You agree. Okay, perfect. If not, guys, we come back. No problem. So we are good. Number four. So help us with number four, Carlos, please. Uh, a powerful. For me? Yes, please. Okay, a powerful tsunami of the coast of Indonesia sparked a three met meter hike. Uh, is one of the words we big waves and waves. So tsunami, you said. Okay, uh -huh. so a powerful tsunami. Big wave. Uh huh. Thanks, okay. So waves. Okay. A three meter high wave that killed at least 130 people. Okay, sounds really nice. Thank you so much for that. Number five, a landslide. Guys, get a landslide. Derrumbe. Deslizamiento. Mm -hmm. Derrumbe puede ser también. Like in Lourdes Colón, right? So there are rock slide or a landslide all the time. Uh, Margarita, please help us with number five. Margarita. Good evening. Hello. Uh, but by the way, su nombre es Daisy in English. I don't know why. <laughs> so you're like Daisy. <laughs> okay, Margarita, help us with number five, please. I lines, I lines. A landslide? Uh, Causa the rain in Sundel. 
China is 21. 21. People missing to die, ending to a grown, growing. Yes. Yes. To from China is war, a tsunami. Se hacen in in a decade. Uh, in a decade. decade. Mm -hmm. decade. Okay. Yes. So, guys, this is a landslide, and it says adding to a growing death story from China worst season. What do you think we can have here? Winter. Winter. Actually, it does make sense. Yes. Do you have any possible yeah, any other sense. possibility? Because it says caused by rains. Anything else? No sé para decir temporada de tormentas también. No sé cómo se dice. Oh well, rainy seasons. So ya tenemos la palabra season too. So words uh, rain. Si ¿Sí podemos decir rainy seasons. Mm -hmm. Winter season sounds actually good as well. Okay, let's leave it like this and ya les doy la respuesta. Number six, guys. Um, so help us with number six. Sure. Yes. I'm sorry, just an observation. <laughs> when the um, when I think I think it was Felix uh, tell us about temporada de tormentas. I just remember about temporada de conejos, temporada de pato. Uh, <laughs> Bunny. Oh, I'm sorry. Nunca vi Bugs Bunny. No, really. So I'm like, ah. I don't remember. So, no, I mean, I thought that. Uh, what do you saw, teacher? Uh, I, I saw Power Rangers, guys. <laughs> that was good, too. Team Power Rangers, too. So I saw Power Rangers, but I like more like China, the Princess Warrior. I don't know if you remember that one. Era called. Uh, so I am from the generation of the last series viejitas, you know, like Highlander, the Renegade, um, what Thunder else? Cars, the A Team, the Thunder Cars, Thunder Cats, yes, and La Espada de la <laughs> yes, he, oh, he was, oh, no, era he -Man. I don't know, what. Los, Los Supersonicos, Yes, super. Wait, the Jetson. Yes. Popeye. Yes, Popeye too. Angelica, <laughs> ¿cuál mencionó? Which one? Los Olímpicos. Los Bocas Piedra. Okay. I don't I like know. the Flintstone firework. Why not, teacher? Panther, la Pantera Rosa. No en el aire. Ah, yes, the Flintstone. Messenger. So you have the Flintstones, Massive right? Los, um, los pica piedras. Chips. Um, chips, chips, chips. Patrulla motorizada. Um, eran los policías en la carretera. Airwolf. En los freeway de, de Los Ángeles. The Power Ranger. No, I don't remember that one. In uh, the beginning of the 80s. 80s. Mm, yo nací en los... En los in the ending, <laughs> in the late the 18 80s. is from that age too. I am early 90s. Magnificus. No, I don't recall that one. Yes, Globo del Aire. That was good. That was really good. But, you know. Manimal. I, animal. Manimal. Manimal. Ajá, era un hombre que se transformaba en cualquier tipo de animal. Mm -hmm. Is that a movie? Yeah, no. Era serie. Es serie. Mm -hmm. Manimal. Manimal. Manimals. Um, ah, yes. No, Manimal, I had never heard that one. Oh, Mowgli. Yeah. Poker. But, but, MacGyver, yes. Pero ahora la nueva versión de MacGyver, uh, okay. I don't like Poker. it. Yeah, Guys, se vieron la nueva versión. MacGyver, I don't know, 2.0. Have you seen it? The remake? Rambo. Uh -huh. I don't know if, if one of you saw Pow Wow. <laughs> Which one? Pow Wow. What? From the 17. 
No, <risa> no, 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 no planeaba todo. Era una Nos caricatura de un minuto. Era de mediados de los setentas. No, I don't think so. But I'm going to look at write it right there in the chat. Buenísima, I'm going to, I'm going to look for that one. El sheriff cuatro plumas. <laughs> No. Are you talking about? No, no, but I saw uh, oh, yeah, Walker Ranger, the, uh, Ranger of Texas, I think. <laughs> so that's the closest I can remember. And... ¿Y Titanes en el ring? La de Novita. Tampoco. Titanes Nadie. ¿Y qué bueno? ¿Cuál es en el ring? ¿Usted sí, Angélica? <laughs> sí. Mi hermana no veía, yo veía con ellos. Ah, buenísimo. But, but was it like Entonces, a wrestling? Uh, Ajá. Pero esa la daban solo los sábados. Oh, I can't remember that. Rafa, what was that? Way too high. Way too high. Escalera al cielo. Pero esa es la novela coreana, right? No, hay una serie. En Canal 8. Are you talking about Channel 8? Yes. Sí, en Canal 8. I had the feeling that I saw it, but I can't remember. No, guys, but I, I never saw those. That is like a heart. So that's why when Belen said it, like, because uh, what was that? Temporada, right? Temporada de yes. cosas. I was like, no, temporada de patas, temporada de conejos. Oh, okay. Like, ah, I can't recall that one. Okay. From Looney Tunes, teacher. Oh, no, you know, from Looney Tunes, I just remember the Kajari. Solo el coyote de Kajari. Oh, yes. And no sé qué otro era el animal. Yes. Y es Pidio González. Temporada de Kofi. Temporada de coffee. <laughs> ok, esa es la versión salvadoreña, right? <laughs> the, the Salvadoreña version. Ok. Espiri González, yeah, guys, those were really good. So, really good programs. Ok, let's finish up yeah, with the pa last pa two pa que pa nos hacen falta. And uh, let's go with number six. Rafa, please, ayúdenos con number six this summer. Summer a dozen. Twister? Which are more common in the US have hit Europe. Mm -hmm. The Twister Witch swept, swept through Poland yesterday. Latin. Mm -hmm. More than. Wow. Order? Four hundred. Four thousand. Four hundred. Wait, yeah, 400. Yeah, 400. Uh -huh. Hectares of woodland mm -hmm. in the area. Thank you so much. So guys, here we have the twister. What is a synonym for twister? What is the other word we can use for twister? Tornado. Tornado. Yes, so this summer a dozen tornadoes. Uh, because we have twister here. Okay, very good. And the last one, the US uh, Navy has been deployed to help over a looming environmental in the Gulf of Mexico. Environmental, guys, del ambiente. ¿Qué pasa con el ambiente? Any idea That's here? Pollution. pollution, exactly. So, an environmental pollution. All right, very good. Guys, solo nos queda la number two because we have the devastation caused by Superstorm Sandy, uh, so disaster, drought, or floating. ¿Cuál de las tres puede ser? Which of them can be? Dolling. It's tragic, but the disaster yeah. or the floating? Floating. Or drought? Floating. Disaster or floating? Disaster, I think. Drought, not anymore. So let's take a look. It's tragic, but the disaster has a, well, actually here, uh, hay dos respuestas. Ahorita se las muestro. Give me a moment. Teacher, what is the difference between Easter and the other one for tornado? 
Oh, es la misma. It's exactly the same. Le podemos uh -huh. llamar Twister o le podemos llamar Tornado. So, that's okay. okay. Deme un second. So, the answer is... One second, guys. Hold on. So the answer is what is the number? Number two, right? Okay. So the answer is, guys, for this one, loading. So there we go. Excellent job, guys. Very, very nice. So we have floatings, we have Droughts, right? We have oh, this is a movie. So this moved a little bit. Uh, we have tornadoes, winter season. This is good. We have pollution, etc. So what are we going to do right now? We are going to move on. Y vamos a hablar un poquito de these thingies, but in regards to the following. So here we have. Um, we have choose a disaster. De los que acabamos de hablar, choose a disaster and make a short description of the risks, causes, give recommendations or a plan to deal with them. For example, guys, imagine there is a fire or there is a volcanic eruption. Alguien vive cerca de volcanes? Do you live close to a volcano? San Salvador's volcano? Santa Ana's volcano? Nadie vive cerca, guys? Do you live close? No, not really. Mi teacher. Oh, you live close. Volcán de San Salvador. Oh, del San Salvador. So, si habría una, una erupción, let's say, eh, si le está bastante cerca de su casa, would it be affected? Yes. Eh, aquí por el redondo del Maferret. Uy, mis, está en la falda. Yes. Oh, ok, ok. Well, but primero Dios, you know, no, it's, it's not going to happen soon or anything, but si llegase a suceder, so sí le afectaría. So it, it will be affected. You'll be affected. All right. Uh, so we have other things like, for example, fires, right? Y me imagino que la mayoría de empresas donde ustedes están han hecho más de alguna vez simulacros or trainings on fire, on earthquake, etc. So guys, uh, for example, si hay un earthquake, si están ahorita in your houses y hubiese un earthquake, ¿qué es lo primero que harían? What would be the first thing that you would do? Wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Scream, oh my God. <laughs> Post your <new> face. <laughs> wrong, Paris. wrong. Okay, so run for your life. Y sus babies, guys. <laughs> So, no, I mean, seriously, si les da miedo, do you get scared? Yes. Okay. Yes. Lo primero que yo hago es buscar a mis yes. hijos. Ah, okay, okay, okay. So that would be the first thing. No gritar, no postearlo, guys. Uh, so, how do you normally react? Cuando hay temblores o terremotos, ¿qué es lo primero que...? que... Um, for example, ¿cuál es el último que recuerdan? What is the last you remember? Evacuación. Evacuación. So you need to evacuate. Exactly. Please. The, 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 first, the first reaction is, Puebla. está temblando. Okay. <laughs> so you get scared, right? Uh -huh. um, Teacher. Yeah. In my case, uh, because uh, maybe I, I have two reactions or uh, freeze out okay. or run away so okay. <laughs> no point in between <laughs> no okay. no it, it depends on the movement and oh. when when well obviously when i was a child and now that i'm uh i don't know how to say older, older yeah mm -hmm. uh, i talk to my family mm -hmm. if i sleep mm -hmm. and and it start to, to shake, shake to uh -huh. shake. Mm -hmm. Don't awake me. Leave me die happy because I'm happy. <laughs> I don't feel Let me die happy. I don't have to wake and try to escape from the 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 la tierra, the movement. I don't know. So leave me die happy. 
Oh, ok, ok. <risa> sí. but, but the thing is that, imagínense que, you know, se despierte por el movimiento. And I'm asking you this, guys, because me pasó hace probably four or five years. Estaba trabajando uh, at, the, at a university and tenía alrededor de 70 chicos, you know, in a class. The thing is that it was like 9 a.m. Y de repente estábamos, ¿Cómo eh, se salvan? we were on the second floor, no estábamos muy alto, we, were, we just were in the second floor, y de repente el proyector, you know, empezó a shake, right? So it was shaking. And, uh, and normally I don't freak out, eh, so it's just like, ah, está temblando. So I was, I was not paying attention to the proyector, pero lo chico fue como, Oh my God, oh my God, I'm gonna die. Y sí, fue bien fuerte. I don't remember, probably five or six, pero sí, fue bien, eh, se sintió bastante. The thing is that one of them got super freak out, o no sé si era por, por llamar la atención. I don't really know what happened, but se quería tirar from the second floor, you know, to the first floor. And I was like, oh my God, these kids are crazy. So, I mean, definitely. <laughs> Todos reaccionamos de forma diferente. So, guys, what is the plan? Um, ¿Se recuerdan del, del 2001? Do you remember 2001 earthquake? Definitely. Yeah. Yes. Like January and February? Where were you? Or how old were you? January. I, I don't was remember. Like six years. Okay. Were you at home? It was a Saturday, I remember. Were you at home? Yes, I am at home. Okay, so, si salieron corriendo, did you go running or something? I was No, in... I was playing. Okay, so I, you're I playing. In... Angelica? I was in galleries. Yes. Oh. The... It, it was awful. It was a, a, a way of panic. Horrible. You can yeah. see the people uh, the screaming. Oh. Okay. Like yeah. pushing everybody away, I guess. Yes. <laughs> yes. Ooh, okay. Uh, we are in the Simán. Okay. The, I don't know how to say it, the Los Maniquís. Uh, ah, the, Manique oh, the Maniquís fell down. Yes, I imagine. Okay. And the, the, the perfumes and the vitrinas explode. The, poof, it, the glass explode, and, but uh, because the the bottles have inside, they have to the all of all of the the product in in exhibition. Todos se fueron para adelante y todos se quebraron. Oh, okay. So it fell and it broke. Like the shelves, the the crystal or the see-through uh, shelves, I imagine. Oh, what did you do? Or were you scared? I I remember I uh, take the arm for my my sister and mm -hmm. I I closed my eyes and I uh I felt oh. he she pulled me up okay. <laughs> and and. and the last thing I remember, I was in the fountain in the center, with a, a, where is the elevator? Uh huh. And see the, all the people running. Oh, I yeah, because I, I imagine especially because it's like panic. Everybody starts panicking. Oh, yeah. wow. Okay, and I imagine especially with the noise, people screaming, a uno también se le pega, right? So we definitely um, get that. Guys, alguien se estaba bañando, do you remember? Were you like in the shower or something? In my case, teacher, I don't remember anything about it. But okay. I think maybe my subconscious maybe do remember because when 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 it's shaking, eh, I freak out. It's like a trauma. Maybe my mind... Um, I don't know, como se diría, como que lo eliminó, pero si you lo block recuerdo. It. So yeah. you, you block my that memory. Block okay. But um, my grandmother told me about it because my grandmother uh, was with us, with my sister and I. But and in she, 2001, how old were you? 
maybe five, five years old. Uh-huh. Yeah, but it's very weird, teacher, because I already, I remember that uh, when I was four years old, mm-hmm. but I don't, I don't remember anything about that, that moment. So that's what I think that maybe my, my, my maybe I, I saw something very difficult or had a trauma for that because I don't remember anything, but I, I do, I did remember uh some some sometimes uh, things about when i was um four years old you have so, some flashbacks know. you have yes, like some, some memories flashbacks. okay okay but the point is that my my grandmother told us that uh, she was with my sister and i and she ran away to the street uh, we was in the centro San Salvador Centro. Oh, okay. uh, so it's like my grandmother uh, run away with with us, with my sister and I, and a couple of things that maybe she told us. Is, uh, all the panic, right? Yes. The panic in the streets, the, the 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 people that try to hide it or or looking for something for some safety place. Uh, so mm-hmm. that's what my grandmother told us. Oh, okay, okay. So, guys, what about the rest of you? What do you remember? Tell me, cuéntanos, guys. Eh, Margarita, where were you? So, Kenya, what do you remember about it? Imelda, tell us um, something about it. Yes. In my case, I remember the second <clears throat> earthquake. Uh-huh. I was uh, at the school, and I remember a, a classmate of, of my brother. Uh, she had um, air problems, uh, a health problem. Oh, okay. Uh, yes. Uh, so when the, when, how do you say, when it started to shake, you can yes. shake or quake. Mm-hmm. Okay. When uh, it started to shake, uh, <laughs> everybody run to the, the, um, uh, la cancha, como se dice? To the basketball, basketball field, basketball court. Yes. Okay. Uh, everybody wrong, and the classmate of my brother, uh, she passed out in the middle of the classroom. But oh. uh, how uh, everybody wrong away? Uh, mm-hmm. She was alone in the middle she of the was classroom. Left behind. La dejaron yes. sola. Yes. <laughs> no. Um, Why? Okay. I, um, hasta que, ¿cómo se dice? Hasta que. Until, until. Until um, the teacher start mm-hmm. to count all the kids. <laughs> mm-hmm. He notes that she wasn't there. So she come back to the classroom and he she uh, found her. Found her, yes, in the middle of the classroom. Poor hair. Yes, but fortunately, uh, she doesn't. She didn't have uh, any problem. Just was a little, uh, como un pequeño desmayo. <laughs> or, or probably uh, she was in shock, right? Yes, because uh, she was very nervous. Yes, that happened. Wow. But put her, nadie le ayudó, nobody helped her. Yes. Okay. Well, <laughs> even <yeah>. the teacher. <laughs> oh, yeah. Now that you mentioned that, that's yes. true. So, as you said, guys, corren por sus vidas, you know, run for your life. No, but I think that uh, back in the, those days, no había como mucha. Um, awareness let's say no no has the unconscious right of some safety things so let's see if we do have a couple of safety plan or like recommendations um so guys definitivamente no salgan corriendo <laughs> don't go running uh, so don't scream uh don't panic uh que mas en, en caso de cualquier eh, emergencia right que mas puede pasarles guys floating uh, ¿Hay riesgo de una floating en esos casos? O que se tapen los tragantes and that Or there is a floating. Mad. ¿O alguien vive en Santa Tecla? Do you live in Santa Tecla, guys? Que ahorita está, like, hay mucho riesgo de, de floating. Sí, aquí sí está feo. <laughs> yeah, que in Santa Tecla, like, a couple of months ago, eh, en la zona donde mi hermana trabaja, you know, se cerró toda la tubería. 
y el carro se le inundó. So her car was like almost uh, covered. So that was like horrible. But guys, let's talk about this. So vamos a hacer un par de grupos. We're going to make some groups. Escojan un tipo de desastre. Uh, probably the most common or the, del que hayan recibido some training, some info. And you can talk about like the causes, right? The reasons and also recommendations or cuál es el plan. So what is the plan in order not to have bigger, bigger issues? So I'm going to ask you guys uh, to join the groups. Uh, so one moment, give me one second and uh, okay. Then that's better. Okay, guys. So we have 10 minutes to do that. Then we present them and that will be it. So let's go, guys. We got 10 minutes. Select one, please.
Already. Um, thank you, guys. Oh, I gave me one second. Okay, thank you for coming back. So, um, first, me alegra que todos tenemos eh, como eventos diferentes. So, escuché the floatings, escuché the um, fires, and I heard um, earthquakes. So, that sounds good. Vamos a, a presentarlos el día de mañana because of the time, you know. So, we are going to be presenting those tomorrow. Guys, eh, para quienes nos acompañaron eh, un poquito you know, más tarde, solamente el recordatorio, tenemos el día de mañana la finalización de módulo. En do, de igual forma ya tendremos que terminar la plataforma también para las um, 10 de la noche. So no se les vaya a olvidar, please. Guys, eh, solamente denme un momentito, les voy a tomar asistencia here and then we are dismissed. So, Andrea, please regale me confirmación. Present, Miss. Thank you so much. I got... Give me one moment. Let me just grab this thing up. Hold on. Hold on. Sorry, my computer is getting um, a little stuck. Teacher, for complete the platform, we have until 10 tonight or tomorrow? Tomorrow. You got tomorrow. tomorrow. Mm -hmm. okay. Yes, porque ya son las 10. <laughs> Not tomorrow, yes. <laughs> Not tomorrow. I worry. Until 10 of tomorrow or at the final of the day? Uh, no, at 10 p.m. tomorrow. Lo que sucede es que eh, necesitamos hacer el, el combinado, you know, eh, de todas las notas. Entonces, para no afectarles, por eso hasta las 10 del día de mañana. So, um, regálenme confirmación, please. Eh, Andrea. No, ya está Andrea Belén, perdón. Yes, teacher, I'm here. Gracias, Carlos. Here, teacher. Thank you, Delmi. Present. Thank you, Enrique. Present. Ya está. Eh, oh, Francisco, falta ahora. Eh, Helen. Imelda. Gracias. Present. Iris. Thank you, Miss. Present. Ar Thank you, Arnoldo. <laughs> Ooh, you're sick. Present. Gracias. Ricardo. Present, teacher. Thank you so much. Kenya. Present, teacher. Angelica. Gaby. Present. Thank you. Rafael. Present. Eh, Margarita. Present, teacher. Thank you. Uh, Judy. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, miss. And uh, Mauricio. I'm here, teacher. Super. Okay, guys. So thanks a lot, everybody. And uh, vamos a presentar el día de mañana en parte de los de la actividad que terminamos ahora, eso se pueden investigar un poquito más, se pueden revisar su vocabulary, sería súper genial y lo presentamos como grupo. Ok, guys, uh, gracias a todos Perfect. por la asistencia, nos vemos mañana. Have a good night, have a really good yeah. night. Bye good bye. Morning, everybody. bye. See you guys. See you guys. Have a good night. Thank you, likewise.